Welcome back love bugs. This is my high bun with a twist tutorial featuring gyra edge control. If you're interested in how I got this look, then stay tuned. So you want to start this look on stretched hair. I'm starting on my heatless blowout, meaning I use no heat to achieve a blowout look. If you want to know how I got it, then click the link in the description box below. So for my buns, I like to gather all my hair on top of my head and use a satin scrunchie to secure it right at the tip so that it's not falling all over the place while I'm trying to secure a ponytail. Now for the lady of the hour, I use my gyra edge control to make sure that my hair is nice and sleek and laid down for this look. This edge control is by far, without a doubt, one of the best edge controls that I've ever tried. I have very extremely frizzy hair and I'm never able to lay down the front of my hair the way I would like uh, using a gel or any kind of edge control. So this is definitely the best edge control that I have ever try and let me tell you I've tried a lot of edge controls Using an old knee-high sock, I put it around my forehead and then I crisscross it, tie it in the back and just push it forward and then in the back I push it up and pull it tight to secure uh, my ponytail as opposed to using a hair tie. Now once you take your scrunchie off and you let your hair hang, you want to try and position your hair all the way around so that it's even on all sides. So just make sure the hair in the front, the sides, and the back is evenly distributed. Now section off a medium piece of your hair and you can use this time to moisturize your hair if you haven't done so already. I already did so I'm going to move right along to detangling my hair with the brush and then on to the bunning process. Twirl the ends of your hair and then wrap it around your finger and you just pretty much continue wrapping it on top of each other until you get to the ponytail. And then you pin it with a bobby pin. It's almost like a pin curl but instead of turning it on its side you just leave it facing straight up. And you literally repeat that same process all the way around your hair. This style looks so complicated, but it's so simple. It's probably one of the easiest styles that I do on a daily basis to go to work or something like that. And what I love about it is it literally does not have to be neat. I didn't even do it that neat in this tutorial just to show you that you can really just throw it together and it'll still look very nice. When I take my time, the style looks even better, but I just wanted to show you if you're in a rush, you can just throw this style together and it really will be your go-to style. I love how smooth and shiny and sleek this edge control left my hair. It's not sticky and tacky like a lot of edge controls and there's literally no product buildup which has been my plight with a lot of edge control products. At night I literally just put a scarf on my head very loosely at the top so it's not weighing the bun down but I just tie it up and I go to bed and I can really rock this for probably a week without having to do too many touch-ups. 
Thank you for watching and I encourage you to check out Gyra Edge Control products. You will not be disappointed. See you in my next video.